Howdy folks, welcome back to Story Song Time with Dan. This is a sequel to episode one, which was called I Thought You Was Dead. So if you want the backstory in detail to this, watch episode one. I'll put the link right here, right now. You got it? Good. Now, without any further ado, I'm going to get on with this one. Me and Will, 50 years later on the banks of the Maclay River, I'm in Australia right now, actually. It's good to be back. Um... This one's called Jungle Perch. Yeah? Like another one. Come on, Will. Hey. <laughs> He's got oh, one. one. Go and bring him in. Oh, uh, uh, you're just, you're not telling the truth. <laughs> Where is he? I'll let him go. So, Pete, you just tell him about what happened. Um, driving along at probably one knot with the lure, with the lure, which is uh, the lure that you saw earlier. Yeah, no, I didn't film the lure. There it is. But we got the bass. There he is. Look, evidence. Yeah. We have caught a bass. Yeah, I caught that. Still winding it in. I'm just going to land it for Dan. There you go. Look. Yeah, look at that. Terrific. Beautiful little Very fish. Clean fish. Yeah. And Are we going to keep him or yeah, throw him back? Turn him off, and um, we'll release him. 
into the wild. Yeah? Yeah, jungle perch. Jungle, jungle perch. <laughs> <laughs> gonna be all right? No, usually they just take off. Yeah. Come on, where are you dumb dumb? There he goes, <laughs> he's gone. You, uh, you, you just fish whispered him. Yeah, that's how it works. That's right. That's how it works, and we're gonna catch another. Oh, we're gonna get a shower of rain here in a second. Yeah, it's um cyclonic weather, yes, which is. means it's like really hot. And then steamy, and then steamy, and then the rain comes and it pisses down, the and pot. then the sun comes out and it burns the sh yeah bejesus out of you. Yeah, only the hardy fishermen are on the river today. That's right. The ones that know what they're doing, and we just showed you how to do it, didn't we, Dan? We sure did. <laughs> 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 oh mate, and you also lured that bass back to life, which I was really impressed by. Okay. Yeah. They're hardy fish. Yeah. The old jungle perch. The old jungle perch. Who knows what happens in the night time around here, boys. I think the big girls come out to play in the night time, so we're just playing around with the little baby ones at the moment. Okay. Yeah. We're not going to do a night time episode, are we? I don't care. Jeez. I would. Try this other. Try this other one here. All right. Okay. Pretty much same same technique. Yep. Well, I'm the king fisherman at the moment. Yeah, you're the king fisherman. We might say king fisher in a yeah, little while. Yeah.
work up at the hospital down in Slippery Rock and make them slippery. <laughs> or sort of slippery. Hey, um, we've come up here to uh, to the scene of the crime. Yeah. Which is where... Um, it's a sad crime. We, we shot Gordon Adamson. I, I shot him. It was an accident. Yeah. But we've decided to come up here 40 years later to um, see if we could find Slippery Rock. And um, I think we found it, haven't we, Will? Yeah, we're right on top of Slippery Rock. If you look down there, you can see that there's uh, an actual rock surface that if you stood on, yeah, you that's it. slip straight into the rock. There we go. Into the water, I mean. Yeah. Look, Slippery as. Yeah. And uh, it's all rock. And this is where we used to sit on the riverbank. And cool off on a 40 degree Celsius day. That's right. We'd sit down here in the water and one of our mates who's li also living in Kempsey now, who's got a motorcycle shop, showed us the way because we didn't drink or anything like that. We were very sober boys. And um, he knew that if he tied a string to the neck of his beer bottle, he could put his beer deeper down into the river in the cool current and in half an hour he'd be drinking a cold can, cold bottle and we'd be sitting there sweating and feeling very thirsty. There you go. And um, yeah, and it's true today. But there used to be a lot more weed in the river at that stage. Yeah, and le less, less of this scrubby here, like, yeah. that's all overgrown, huh? It's all overgrown and the reason why it's overgrown is because they haven't burned it. And they, we used to um, religiously burn the riverbank to the, you know, the fear of all the residents. But it, it kept all the lantana and all the scrubby stuff away, and you could get down there and yeah. swim. Hey, Will, tell us about the um, the woman in the nurse's gear. So you told, tell me that story about the nurse. I don't have a very good story about her, but I think she went to school with us in uh, Kempsey High School. Yeah. And um, she was attracting a fair bit of attention, but she moved up up to being a nurse in the uh, hospital just above us here in the in the town. And um, she's a local girl. But now she cleans houses and she's resurrected her uh, nurse's uniform and she wears it to clean houses. So she's maintained her um, grasp on reality by being what she was 30 years ago. There you go. <laughs> and she does look quite attractive in a yeah. light blue nurse's uniform. Walking and getting about down in the nurse's uniform. Yeah. Without a worry. She's maintained her um, figure. Yeah. Without a worry. She's married though. She's married to some guy. We'll never know. Well, that was a good story. So it wasn't just blokes that came down here to do mud sliding and no. swimming and drinking and. This is our mud slide here, isn't it? Oh yeah. No, the mud slide's probably gone. The mud slide's ago. gone. Yeah. What a hangout for yep. a young kid. Yep. Just uh, weren't, we weren't scared of. Of course, there was a lot of weed in the river then, and you could get tangled up in it a bit. That was really scary getting tangled up in the weed. Yeah. That the weed? part of the that part of the indigenous um, concept is that the weed was the hairy man. Oh yeah. Or the yowie, and yeah, um, yeah. the little kids had to be aware of the yowie because yeah. if they got tangled up in it. It sucked the, you in. Yeah, the yowie, the the, the, the um, hairy man would drag you under under the water and take your children from you. Yep. Bit sad. Bit sad in a way. But now, Danny and I have caught, I think we've caught probably 10 fish each today on the river, on the Maclay River.